Dear colleagues, your attention is invited to a report on the topic multi-agent clinical decision support system using case-based reasoning. Nowadays, the problem of creating decision support systems for the DSS, which are increasingly used in solving complex, difficult, formalized problems, which are in particular the task of diagnosing various diseases in medicine. Since it's impossible for experts to diagnose the disease in a large number of people, the application of mathematical methods that have found application in model clinical decision support systems, CDSS FASA, can help. There are limitations to the known methods and technologies currently used in clinical decision support systems. These limitations can be addressed using the synergies between multi-agent systems, MESH, and case-based reasoning, CBR. Thus, CDSS research based on MESH, which uses CBR to increase the effectiveness of the implementation of mechanisms for learning and adaptation to the specifics of the problem environment, are important and relevant. The paper aims to develop intelligent clinical decision support systems using multi-agent technologies, which is to study methods aimed at integrating agents into systems as well as algorithms for using precedent-based reasoning to increase the ability of agents to make decisions. The general structure of multi-agent clinical decision support systems for diagnosing diseases is shown on the slide 7 and consists of three high-level modules – an interface module, an execution module, and a knowledge module and multi-agent system. The multi-agent CDSS model is represented as a table where A – agents Environment E is a software platform for executing agents and provides functionality for creating destroying agents for receiving and or transmitting messages. RES is a service-oriented environment that provides a service to support the identification of possible heart disease cases. In the case based reasoning, multi agent system shown on slide 9, each agent is described by a corresponding set. The main agents are Search Agent, Adaptation Agent, Improvement Agent, Execution Agent, Evaluator, User Interface Agent, Decision Making Agent, Report Agent, Database Agent. The precedent in general case may include the following components Task Description, Problem Situation, Problem Solving, Diagnosing the Problem Situation and Decision Maker Recommendations the result or forecast of the application of the solution. In most cases, for the presentation of precedence is a simple parametric representation, the representation of a precedence in the form of a set of parameters with specific values and solutions. To determine the value of the degree of similarity S, it's, it's necessary to find the maximum distance Dmax in the selected metric. To combine CDSS agents and CBR agents, you need to connect the search agents to the decision agent. The architecture of the system is shown on the slide 11 and the sequence diagram is shown on the slide 12. In the CBR system itself, the application first goes to the search agent, which solves the function of finding case most similar to the problem. In the passes, the result is the adaptation agent, which determines the difference between the selected cases and the problem, and, if necessary, applies a set of necessary rules to make the old solution best suited to the new problem. The enhancement agent then criticizes the adaptation solution against the previous result, and, after the solution is criticized, the execution agent applies the refined solution to the current problem. At the end, the evaluator stores the result in the precedent database for further use and sends the result to the decision agents who in turn returns the result to use through the coordination agent. Experimental studies of the system were conducted on the example of diagnosing heart disease. For the test systems for diagnosis of heart disease, a data set was used, which has more than 300 records and has 14 attributes, which are shown on slide 13 and 14. 
Four possible solutions to the problem have been provided for the decision maker, including a precedent with complete similarity. Therefore, based on the obtained data, it can be concluded that although there is a precedent with a similar to the initial one with heart disease, but based on the work of CDSS, the chance of diagnosing the disease in a person with these indicators is low. The distribution of time between agents for decision making is shown on slide 15. To make one decision, the system needs about 170 milliseconds, which is a good indicator, but can be approved if additional decision making agents are added to the system, which will allow to horizontally scale the resulting system. The result of testing the performance of the system depending on the number of precedents in the database is shown on slide 16. As a result of testing, we can say that also with the increase of the number of precedents in the database, the execution time really increases, but it's slow and doesn't significantly affect the overall running time. The experiment showed the ability of CDSS, so it can be used to make decisions in real conditions. In general, the following conclusion can be drawn from the work. CDSS is proposed, which is designed to improve healthcare delivery by improving medical decisions through focused clinical knowledge, patient information and other medical information. CDSS is based off a multi-agent approach in case-based reasoning and consists of models of interface, execution and knowledge that include various agents. Multi-agent technology is used to obtain, reuse and adapt precedents in the case-based reasoning system. The CBR system removes cases related to an existing disease from the database of precedents and solves the issue of deciding the diagnosis of the disease based on the results of previous data on such a disease. Experimental studies of the proposed CDSS to support the identification of possible heart disease show the effectiveness of the proposed solutions reducing the response time of the system by an average of 15%. Thank you for your attention.